Here's Lily. I should have called it Here's Lucy um, after that show that used to be on TV. But she's been, yeah, getting rather upset with me so far because I haven't opened the door for her. And uh, I'm opening the door for her. And now she'll probably be sulking at me and putting it down to, well, you just took way too long, Mum. But I don't think she'll miss an opportunity to to come on out now that the door is actually open. What do you think, Lil? Coming out now that you've you've kind of done a little bit of a wreck the place. What do you think? You want to come outside? I'm thinking that it's time for uh, the restroom, as Uber Gooba Lady puts it. You need to go to the restroom, don't you? Hey, problem is guys, you know, I know a lot of you are sitting in snow and it's freezing and it's cold and it's all of that and, you know, we're sitting in the heat and the hot and, and it is heat and hot. But I'm going to, doesn't take much to get Lily to come on out, there's no... I'm not drip, gripping with my tail, Mum. You just uh, pull me out and I'm ready to go. So I'm going to put her uh, around my shoulders as I do. And before she goes slip sliding off, because she doesn't realise I'm, I'm going to stand up and we're going to go, we're going outside. Okay? We're going to go outside. Can you grip around that way for Mum? Please? Go around that way for a second. Can you go around that way for Mum? And grip under me that way? Thank you. That's very good. That's more comfortable for her and me together. So, oh, what did you do? Bump your nose? Yeah, Miss Tessa's up there. Which, uh, I'm sure that once Lily realises there's another climbing area up there, she'll be well and truly I'm up there at some stage checking it all out. So that's good for me. And she'll have a nice warm area up there to lay her, herself on and uh, warm her belly up on too with the heating. Uh, oh gosh. I can't even think of the name of it. Panel. Heat panel. See, it's early. And I'm, oh, I forgot the blanket. I ain't sitting on that grass with no blanket. All those green ants, they love me. And I don't really want to or plan on being bitten by them today if I can avoid it. And it's, it's the initial bite is what it is. But my goodness, it just hurts for ages and then it goes into itchy mode the next day and you have to avoid itching. I'm pretty good at that because um, I'm not a scratcher or a picker. I know a lot of people are but most aren't so I'll be back in a second. Sorry guys. Kids, uh, kids and kids and it's a busy time and we're all getting ready for school you know the usual I like it when there's no school I can kind of chill a little bit I'll let Lily you go go down on the ground bub okay there's the ground this is the best time of the day early because otherwise it's just way too hot. I'm just waiting for it to let go of me, as you can see, hopefully. Um, I have no idea where I'm pointing it right now. <laughs> let go, Baba. Let go, Mum. You can let go of me, okay? Oh, cool. Well, that's better. It's way better. 
And you're gonna go out in the hot sun. He? Yesterday wasn't too bad actually. We um, had a little bit of a cooler breeze or at least a breeze blowing through but uh, you know I have okay it's a beautiful sunny day outside but you've got to be so mindful of the temperatures as well and have places where you know for me like they need to go to the toilet and I have to and I know that that's what they're needing so I have to bring them outside when they're being frantic about that and see these little green ants I don't know if you can pulling around there but they hurt they're the ones that hurt what you looking at Lil? I can hear birds but I can't see birds but yes you do have to be very mindful and at this time of the year being the case that I know it's like I need to go outside and that's fine but I don't stay out here very long uh, once we start hitting the April that's when I can come outside and pretty much know that that Sun is not scorching uh, it's it's just so hot it really is and you know there's they have the ability to go up under the trampoline to get out of that Sun so it's not about just sticking them out with nowhere where they can actually seek shade if they are starting to get warm so um, yeah hot weather it's great to have it and I live in I, I'm not complaining because I live in such a, a a state in Australia that we get more warm than we ever do cold and in actual fact I don't think that we get winter to be perfectly honest I I know that last year I wondered where winter was and it never just got to that point where we oh I, I'm feeling cold today I continued to live in singlets and short sleeve tops and really there might have been the odd night if I was actually going outside I'd, I'd throw a wrap around me and uh, go outside but otherwise I don't my winter clothes what are winter clothes and I have got some because we have needed it at times but not last year I didn't even look at buying any winter clothes last year because of the fact that there was no winter what you doing sweetie? Hey, what can you see? what can you see? hey I see you. I see you. I tell you what, this is when you see your snakes shine. I'm not meaning their, their scales shining, just them as who they are. Hey. Hey, Lil. What do you think? A bit warm in that sun, isn't it, today? Hey? A bit warm? I'm thinking it is. And I'm a human. Are well, you going to stay pretty close today? Go do Lily. Now that was actually the other day. Heading off and going off somewhere. Where are you gonna go?
up by the side. I can see. I can see your head, can see your tail. Spin around, around. Just can't beat sitting outside. And I'm over my batteries just putting them in and getting very little time so I'm definitely going to have to go online and uh, order in more batteries for this camera. Hey Lily. But anyway guys, it was just going to be a short video. Um, you know, just saying that I appreciate the hot weather and it's great being able to bring my snakes out but you know if you do live in a really hot climate just be aware of that you know we're feeling the heat our snakes are feeling the heat and that goes for inside the home as well be mindful that your house heats up and they do require cooler and warmer so yeah it's important for them to cool off and warm up isn't it Lil so I hope you enjoy this little video with Lily and I will say take care of yourself your family and your snakes and of course any animal that you have in your life So ciao.